In this video, we'll write the electron configuration for francium and the francium ion, FR1+. So let's start with francium. I've already written it out. It's kind of long. So what we'll do is figure out how I came up with this. The first thing I want to show you is if we look at the periodic table, we can think of it divided into these blocks, like the D block and the P block and the S block. And if we count down the periods, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, we can see francium right here. It's in the seventh period or seventh row, and it's in this group one. So francium should be 7s1. That's what it should end in. And if you look at our configuration, 7s1. So you can use the periodic table here to help you know what that last term is going to be. So with that information, let's figure out the rest of this. So this chart with what we call the diagonal rule, that'll help us figure out the rest of what we have here. First off, we need to know that francium on the periodic table, its atomic number is 87. It has 87 protons. And since it's neutral, there's no negative or positive sign after it, it'll have 87 electrons. All these numbers here are going to add up to 87 when we're done. So we start out, we go to 1s, and s can hold up to 2. So we have 2, that's full. We go to 2s, that holds 2. 2s is full. 2p. P can hold up to 6, so we fill that up with 2P6. We've used 10 electrons so far. 3S2, 3P6, 4S2. After 4S2, we go to 3D10. So 3D, the D orbitals, they hold up to 10. So we go from 3D10, 4P6, 5S2, 4D10, 5P6, 6S2. And from 6S, we do go to the 4F. F's can hold up to 14. So we have our 4F14, our 5D10, our 6P6, and we've used at this point 86 electrons. Remember, we only have 87. So that last S orbital, even though S holds two, we only need one more. So we put one in it. We end with 7S1. So this is the electron configuration for francium. If we wanted to make this a little bit easier to read, we could use what's called condensed notation. We'll write the noble gas before francium. We put it in brackets. So all of this right here, this is the electron configuration for Rn. Francium has one more electron than Rn, so we have our 7s1. We put that out here. And these are considered the valence electrons for francium. If we wanted to write the ion, Fr+, plus, all we do is we get rid of this last electron. For positive, we've lost an electron. So we get rid of the last electron. Can write zero. Some people cross it out. Don't include it. I like zero. Put a zero here too. So this would be the electron configuration for Fr+. Note that sometimes you'll see a slightly different order. For example, the 4s is sometimes written after the 3d. That's okay. Either way is correct. This is Dr. B with the electron configuration for Fr and Fr+. Thanks for watching.